Hey gang, I'm Professor Sill and this is my secret to defending or to maintaining my triangle choke against bigger, heavier opponents that are trying to crush me. Um, I love triangle chokes even with my short legs against the big strong guys. I still go for it if he offers me his neck. Uh, I'm going to show you guys the setup for it and then I'm going to show you what goes wrong because if he stacks me, he's going to end up passing my guard. So let's show you what might go wrong and then after that, I'll give you the solution to that. I'm with Chris Bacalos here. Say hi, Chris. Hi. And uh, so here's my triangle setup. I usually grab the, the collar or I grab the neck if it was a street fight because in, in, at this distance it's very dangerous for the punches in a real street fight. And that's a big difference between Gracie Jiu Jitsu and Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. In Gracie Jiu Jitsu we always worry about the punch, you know. But now we're talking about sport and stuff like that so let's just check it out. So I'm grabbing his collar in a street fight it would probably be his head more. And then I open up my guard and I want to clear this arm here and I'm going for my triangle choke. Now if I'm not careful, a lot of people what they'll do is they'll start stacking me crushing me and then boom he ends up passing my guard and then I'm in a lot of freaking trouble. So I can't let that happen. So as I start going for my triangle choke and I feel him starting to put the weight on me, I'm going to put my structure together and I'll explain to you what I mean by my structure and you'll see that it's going to keep this guy away and even a lot of strong guys, well, they'll burn themselves out before they get the triangle choke. So let's watch. So I've got my collar here, I'm going to open up my guard, clear his arm. And when I open up my guard, a good habit is to keep my foot up there on his hip, use my knee to overlap, even if he's got a good grip here, as I start stretching my leg, it's going to get him to let go. And as I start wrapping up and going for the triangle choke, oh, I see that he's starting to put his, head, his weight on me. So I'm going to structure here, I'm going to grab my tibia, and my other foot's going to push away on his hip. And this structure here, every time he tries to come towards me, he's going to get himself tired. He's going to make it, my whole body move back. And then as he gets tired, then I can finalize the triangle choke and pull everything down into the floor. You know, I might have waited a little longer in a regular match, but for video's sake, we did a little quicker. There's no rush in a real fight. What's important is to survive the fight. Winning or losing, I don't want to lose, obviously, but I want to survive the fight. If I can win, that's a bonus. But surviving is the first thing. So structure, and then finish afterwards. If you like the video, please like, comment and share the video and in the comment section if ever you have any suggestions or a position that you're having a hard time with let us know and it'd be our pleasure to do a specific video just for you thank you